Hi, this is The Business Guy. So how do you get small business grants to start your business? Where do you get free money to get started and how much can you get? We're gonna go step by step and go over the resources of free money for your business and exactly what to do and who to contact. There are US government agencies, state and regional funding sources, grants from corporations such as FedEx, startup grants, and specialty grants. But first, if you appreciate this free information, please click the like button below so YouTube promotes this video, many thanks. And you can also click the subscribe button below if you haven't already so that when more videos come out like this, you'll be up to date right away. So here's a list of grants for free money for your business. Federal small business grants. Government agencies are among the biggest distributors of business grants supporting a range of enterprises from environmental conservation to childcare services. Applying may seem intimidating, but federal grants are great opportunities for small business owners looking to grow. Number one, Grants.gov. Now, Grants.gov is a comprehensive database of government small business grants administered by different federal agencies, such as the Department of Education and Veterans Affairs. Now, before you all apply, you'll want to first set up your corporation or LLC. I like LLCs better for most people because of the better legal protection. You'll apply for the grant in your company name and not your own name. By the way, that's what we do. We set up companies in all 50 states. So give us a call at one. 954 41050 or visit our website at companiesinc.com to set up your company. Now give them the code BG25 for $25 off your company for a limited time. And I recommend you do that right now because that's your first step. And hey, you'll have to do it anyway. So if you're serious, give us a call. Now don't give us a call about grants. The video does that. Just call us about setting up your company. Number two, small business innovation research and small business technology transfer programs. Wow, that's a mouthful. The SBIR and STTR grant programs focus on research and development for technology innovation and scientific research. This program helps connect small businesses with federal grants and contracts from 11 different government agencies. Well, great, how much can you get? The grant amount starts at $150,000. Promising and successful candidates can receive up to $1 million in additional funding to qualify. You must operate a for-profit business and have no more than 500 employees and meet other eligibility requirements. Number three, USDA Rural Business Development Grants. The U.S. Department of Agriculture administers the Rural Business Development Grant Program, which provides financing to strengthen and grow small businesses in rural communities. Businesses have to have fewer than 50 employees, less than a million dollars in gross revenue, and be located in an eligible rural area to qualify. Applications are accepted through the USDA rural development or local state offices. Number four, program for investors in micro entrepreneurs, that's prime. The SBA doesn't typically offer grants directly to small businesses. The prime program, however, offers federal grants to micro enterprise development organizations so they can provide assistance to disadvantaged micro entrepreneurs. These organizations, such as the Nebraska Enterprise Fund, the Micro Enterprise Services of Oregon, both of which awarded funding can be private nonprofits or run by state, local, or tribal governments. Next are the state and regional small business grants, and these include number one, Economic Development Administration. The U.S. Department of Commerce Agency provides grants, resources, and technical assistance for communities to support economic growth and encourage entrepreneurship and innovation. Each state's agency helps businesses find financing, including state or regional grants, secure locations, and recruit employees. You can search the Economic Development Directory for regional offices and local resources. Number two, small business development centers. Your local SBDC provides support for small businesses and aspiring entrepreneurs. They're often associated with local universities or a state's economic development agencies, and many help connect you with small business grants as well as business financing opportunities, plus counseling, training, and technical assistance. Number three, Minority Business Development Agency Centers. The MBDA runs a national network of business centers dedicated to growing and promoting minority-owned small businesses. These centers 
help business owners access capital, secure contracts, and compete in emerging markets. Your local MBDA center can help you apply for a debt-based financing as well as federal, state, and local business grants. The agency usually holds an annual small business grant competition and provides updates on this contest on its website. Lastly, number four, State Trade Expansion Program, or STEP. The SBA funds state grants to implement the STEP grant program, which helps small businesses cover the cost to start or expand into international markets. The available funding amounts and the eligibility criterion of these government small business grants may vary based on your state, but capital can be used to participate in export trade shows, design international marketing products, support website globalizations, and more. Now, next are the corporate small business grants. Many corporations and large companies have philanthropic components that include small business grants. While some provide grants to nonprofits servicing specific industries only some give to four profit companies. Number one, FedEx Small Business Grant Contest. The company's annual grant competition awards over $250,000 to 10 small businesses, including a $50,000 grant and $4,000 in FedEx print and business services to its three grand prize winners. The contest is for U.S.-based for-profit small businesses that have been operating for at least six months with no more than 99 employees. Number two, the National Association for the Self-Employed. NASE members can apply for monthly small business grants worth up to $4,000 as well as annual $3,000 college scholarships for members' dependents. Grants are awarded year-round with completed applicants reviewed quarterly in January, April, July, and October. Number three, fast break for small business. The NBA, WNBA, and NBA G League have partnered with Accion Opportunity Fund to offer $10,000 grants and up to $500 in legal services for small business owners. This program focuses on helping businesses in underserved and underrepresented communities. Applications are open twice a year. Number four, Patagonia Corporate Grants Program. Nonprofits striving to preserve and protect the environment can apply for the small business grant to the Patagonia Corporate Grants Program. The retailer looks for innovative business with proposed projects that are quantifiable and have specific goals, objectives, and action plans. These nonprofit grants typically fall between $5,000 and $20,000. Finally, number five, Visa Everywhere Initiative. The Visa Everywhere Initiative is a grant competition that offers funding to tech-forward startups across five different regions around the globe. Applicants must show how they've developed a product or service that creatively involves Visa products. Visa will select the top five finalists in each region, and these businesses will move forward to a global final event. The overall winner of the competition is awarded a $100,000 small business grant. Additional grants are awarded to second and third place finalists, audience favorites, as well as regional and local winners. Next are the business startup grants. If you're looking for free money to start your business, you may have more difficulty finding available federal grants. Some state and local governments, as well as private companies, however, offer startup grants for small businesses. Number one, the U.S. Chamber of Commerce Dream Big Awards. The annual Dream Big Awards recognizes the small businesses for their contributions to the U.S. economy and offers a grant of $25,000. And the competition also gives to businesses in a variety of categories, such as emerging businesses and green sustainable businesses with associated prizes. Although you must have an existing business to qualify, you need have been in operation for only one year. Number two, Hello Alice Grant Platform. Hello Alice partners with a variety of companies such as Progressive and DoorDash to offer different grants for small businesses, including startups. You can create an account to receive notifications about new opportunities and apply to these grants that are relevant to your business. Number three, Comcast Rise. Through the Comcast Rise program, startup businesses can receive free marketing services and technology makeovers. These awards are given quarterly to businesses that have been operational for at least one year. To qualify, you also need to be located within the Comcast or Effective TV service area, and your business must be 51% owned by somebody who identifies as a woman or a person of color. Number five, 
Amber Grant Program for Women. Women's Net offers the $10,000 monthly Amber's Grant and awards two $25,000 grants on an annual basis. The foundation also gives additional funding throughout the year. To qualify for any of the grants offered by Women's Net, businesses only have to fill out a single application. Startups and existing women-owned businesses are eligible. And finally, specially small business grants. To help spread entrepreneurial success across demographics, many organizations focus on funding efforts on specific communities. There are small business grants for women, small business grants for veterans, small business grants for minority groups, small business grants for black women. Alternatives to small business grants. Finding and applying for the right grants for your small business can be difficult, as well as time consuming. If you don't qualify for certain grants, there are other ways to fund your business, and here are some avenues is to explore the small business loan. Compare loan options including bank loans, SBA loans, business lines of credit, term loans, and equipment financing, plus learn how to choose the right financing for your needs. Now, I'm not a fan of debt, but if this is your only source of capital startup, it is a consideration. Small business credit cards. Explore dozens of cards and find your best choice for funding, everyday business purchases, and earn rewards in the process. Again, stay away from credit cards if you can, so I'm just including this as an option. Better yet, crowdfunding for business. Raise money for your small business by tapping into the power of the internet and promoting your product or service through a crowdfunding campaign. These include Kickstarter, Indiegogo, Patreon, Crowdfunded, and GoFundMe. So those are some of your best sources of money as well as free money to start your business. Remember, it takes work. So do the work and the rewards will be staggering. Apply for as many grants as you can. It's like shooting free throws. You won't hit every one, but the more you shoot, the more you score. So go for it. Now it's up to you to take action. Please like, subscribe, and share this video with others. See you next time. This is The Business Guy.